Hello, everybody, and welcome to The Deliberate Zoomer. This, uh, this show we shot, uh, Michael Simonton and myself, uh, we've just finished shooting it today, and we wanted to just record this quick introduction to the show uh, to kind of give you an idea of, of how, how this came about, what we were looking to accomplish for it, uh, for you as you listen to these, to these short episodes as you go forward. And by the way, thank you so much for, you know, for being here and for joining us um, on this little journey that we've had. So just to kind of give a, a brief background on the reason that I came up with this, this idea to, to do the show was it's kind of twofold was I read the book, um, the, the defining decade by Meg J and I was just very st- struck by all of the amazing things that she talked about with her clients, uh, being, uh, going from, you know, their twenties and all the struggles that they had that she shared. And I thought that it would be very helpful to create kind of a guide a resource, whatever you will call it for people in their twenties. And you know, obviously a lot of those people are going to be in the Gen Z range. So that's why we've called the show this. And, um, so, so that's the goal here is to create a type of, I guess there's a mini series, a little resource for people to use, you know, whether they're 15 to 25, whatever it is, somewhere in that range. And you're going through your twenties, trying to figure life out, trying to understand what you want to do, you know, how to live your life. Right. So that's kind of the resource we've, we've come up with here. Uh, and we've had a, tough, uh, a lot of fun making it, right? So it's been a lot of fun where Michael and I just talked about the different topics. Um, and I guess I would just ask, you know, initially, Michael, what, do you, what would you recommend for people to kind of go into this, how they should go into this, uh, these, these series? What, what should they expect? And, and how do you want them to, have be, to be disposed to it? Absolutely. So I'd say that whenever you approach anything uh, like this or a topic like this, the best way to approach it is to consume the material in a manner and so, uh, so much that you could speak to it afterwards. So personally, uh, this would be the type of podcast that I'd listen to and I would take notes randomly. I'd, I'd record my, my initial thoughts or afterwards and like what made me think of this. And then uh, if you want to be even on top of that. Uh, and I do that just so it like solidifies and I remember it a little bit more, but if you want to go another step farther, I would also take the advice, you know, listen to what's being said and, and really reflect on it and figure out how it applies to you. And then also write that down. So record that so that you can have that to reference because uh, what we talk about here is really, you know, how to structure your life, how to live a little bit more deliberately. So you set yourself up for success in the future and ending success now. And so I think that if you approach it with an, with an open mind, um, realize that everything we say, you know, can be taken to heart. And it is all applic- applicable to all of us, even if we don't want to admit it or we don't think it's one of our problems or anything like that. It's all applicable and approach it with an, op- an open mind and, and a, w- a willingness to, to take that deep look at yourself and realize, you know, yes, I mean, the foundation, the premise is, is correct. And, and if we want to live our lives deliberately, if we want to do great, how can we go about this and then take it from there? Yeah. And then just kind of to, to also recap what would, what we've done here is a lot of these are us sharing our experiences personally with what we've learned as we've, you know, as we've um, grown in our professional lives and personal lives uh, throughout our twenties, but also what we've learned from, from other resources that we've consumed because Michael and I are both pretty avid re- readers. Um, as I'm sure a lot of people listening, you know, you've obviously come here, because you have a disposition towards these things. So we appreciate that. But again, yeah, go into it realizing that this is, these are very simple principles. You know, Michael and I are not experts by any means on, on any of these things, but we can share what we know and it can be very valuable. Like these principles are things that I've learned from people much older than me that they're very simple again, but they really can go a very long way. And uh, I guess another thing to just kind of essentially mention is that, this is all founded on the principle and the, and the understanding that your that as humans, we have the ability to do a lot of things in our twenties. Like we can, we can create habits more easily. We can learn things quicker. It's kind of like a second childhood from what I've been, what I've read is like when you're growing up, you have this just massive amount of ability to, to take in things and to absorb things. And now this, now that you have your, your, your reason and your intellect really formed to some extent, you can, then use that intellect and reason to form what you become to basically sculpt this version of yourself that you want to have for the rest of your life. But you can now do it with intention and while still learning more things, right? You can really focus on what exactly it is you want 
rather than what your parents just taught you. So again, go into it with an open mind about like, this is just some experience of ours. And I think that this really can be beneficial to the people listening to essentially, I guess, create a, a, a just a place to come back to, you know, once a year, once every few months, whatever it is, to, to watch some of these episodes that specifically hit home to you. Uh, again, do take notes on the ones that are most, most vital to you. Um, the, the other reason that I wanted to shoot this up, this show uh, that I didn't mention yet is that this is also for me, right? This is for Michael and I. We wanted to shoot this because we know that just because we've talked about this and we've had these discussions, we're not going to stick to these things perfectly. We're going to need a resource to come back to. So we've created this resource not only for you but for ourselves. So we're working together here to, to create something that we hope is, hope is valuable. Um, please feel free to, again, as you go through, take notes, hit us up on any, any questions you have along the way. Um, and we'll be glad to have conversations. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for take, going on this journey with us and we hope you enjoy the show. We, again, we had a ton of fun shooting it and, um, we hope it, we hope it provides a lot of value to you. Thank you so much and enjoy the deliberate zoomer. <laughs>